Hello, Stephen. Uh, belated welcome to GRA 220 in cyberspace. This will be some final, not final, uh, some feedback, video feedback on the uh, print ad. And uh, we've got four weeks to go. So if you have any questions or if I can encourage you, let me know. Uh, <clears throat> Stephen, your ingredients, um, as humble as they are, are unique and inviting. But I do think it needs uh, some kind of tropical context, don't you? And uh, that inviting reclining chair, you know, against the beach uh, <laughs> is a, 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 a unique combination of visual imagery. Um, I would use the Style Guides version of the logo and it's pretty easy to import. Um, so let me show you how to do that. Uh, I'm an illustrator. Um, I'm going to open the style guide and hopefully that will come up quickly. Yeah, here it is. And um, just click through that. Here it is. Now I'm going to use uh, the, one of the select tools, doesn't really matter which, to select the logo. I'm going to copy it, depending on what system you're on, and mine is Command C, to the clipboard. I'm going to go back to the, oops, that's caissons. Uh, I'm going to create a layer for it. So, um, and I want to add that your your layer structure uh, is really nice. So let's see, here we go. Here is your layer structure. Um, okay, create a layer, uh, paste the logo, and you know size and refit as necessary so definitely go ahead and you know make that change um, because it's it's really hard to recreate a logo in this time that we have and besides it's really not the uh, emphasis of the course so think about organizing your um, text you know keep the number of sizes to a minimum I would say maybe if you can get away with it just two sizes think about uh, not only context, but also contact information. You know, how do you want the uh, the viewer to uh, reach the uh, resort? And um, good job on, on importing a masked image and also in adjusting the colors of that image. Okay, I'm going to leave it here. Um, play around with the ingredients. Now, yours is one of the rare examples where I would say it needs more, you know. Most other people just pile it on, but I think in your case, um, it's good to be spare, but I think you need a little bit more context.